All right, it's Carnage, and I have been working on a kit bash of Dr. Biggles Jones for some time now. Uh, this is the uh, Marvel Legends X-Men Myra McTaggart buck. Um, I have a different head. I'm thinking this is a... I don't know, honestly. I can't remember which head this is. But uh, it sort of looks like some of the later versions of uh, Dr. Biggles Jones, minus the long hair, that she did have that nice uh, hair coming down on her face. But uh, I did add a um, water slide decal from uh, our friends at Bad Mother. And... Uh, Gave her her Cobra insignia there on her jacket, and I think that's a nice touch. Um, I do need to match up her neck uh, with the color of the head sculpt if I am indeed going to keep that one. But uh, I'm pretty pleased. I think she's got a kind of a sinister look with that head sculpt. And uh, I think we're there for our Dr. Biggles Jones. It doesn't have to be anything uh, outlandish. <clears throat> Just someone to uh, perhaps assist Dr. Mindbender. Dr. Biggles Jones was initially kidnapped by Cobra, but she came to be a Cobra sympathizer and eventually would join Cobra. So I think she's an interesting character. Uh, I can think of some different uses for her as far as photography and some different uh, storylines. So this is my latest G.I. Joe Classified Custom. I have been really not doing much action figure customs at all. I got into it uh, pretty heavy initially uh, earlier on in the series when we didn't have so many figures. Now that we've got so many figures, I just haven't seen uh, much need for me to do any kind of customs myself. But um, occasionally I do, and this is one. This is Dr. Biggles Jones. This is Carnage saying thanks for watching. Please hit the like button. Please subscribe. Please even consider notifications. This group this page is only about G.I. Joe Classified. Thanks for watching.